Wow, I missed you. I missed it. Oh well. I was trying to get him to run and jump right into me. Did you stash something in my pocket? I'll have to check. Yes, he did. He stashed the hazelnut, guys. That's too funny. I wish I would have gotten it better him running towards me. I'm sorry, guys. I did not think he was going to run towards me and stash something in my pocket. He must, he, he's packing my lunch for work. Hey, buddy. Hey, Bud Bud, what you doing? I love you, buddy. Let's go follow him. Hey, it's not time to be in there yet. I stashed the hazelnut in there the other day for him to find. And um, when I first cut it open, because it was spoiling and I wanted him to eat it, so when I first cut it open, um, I saw him stash a walnut in there. It was so hilarious. And yes, guys, he does the best stuff when I'm not recording. I apologize. I really do try to get really fun and unique stuff, but it's just so hard. And like I said, uh, I can't. I I I want to get like a mount for my hel uh, my head because like so much. Do you want water? Hit it again. You want water, you gotta hit it again. Oh, he's hitting it. Okay, okay, okay. Here you go. Here you go. So much of the best stuff um, happens when I can't, when I need, when I need like two hands just to hold him. He falls asleep in my hands. Or he'll run up and jump in my jump in my arms and then cradle himself, or like just bury himself into the elbow nook, and then just be like, "You will cuddle. We will cuddle now." Hi. So. And he's just been a sweetheart the last couple of days. He did s snip at my feet yesterday. When I was, um, but I was wearing socks. Um, but that was the first time he really, really snipped at my feet in a long time. Because he did his little growl and snip. And I think it's because I was just walking around and I was, wasn't really paying attention too much. And they were, it was like, it was up in the air. And he's like, no, you pay attention. You watch where you put your feet. He does not like my feet. Because I used to step on him on accident. Um, because he would just be always running around my feet and I would always watch where I would go, but sure enough, I would step on him. And like one time I saw him kind of do like a squirrel, put up your dukes, uh, kind of like thing, but, it, and I heard him go, Kah! and then I looked down and he was like, like I said, kind of like growling and putting up, <laughs> doing the put up your dukes with his hands and I was on his tail. And, of course, I got off his tail, and then he settled down. And I was very proud of him that he settled down. And then I made sure that I pet him, and I said, I'm sorry. And, uh, but anyway, uh, it, it was too hot. Yesterday I had my socks on because it was cool. But the day, a couple of days before, I had my socks off because it was just too hot in the house to have the socks on. And I needed to just kind of calm down. I mean, you know, cool off where I could. And yes, he thinks my house is an obstacle course, which is fine by me. And, uh, so anyway, uh, and so he's been biting my feet. Um, exploratory bites, nothing sinister, but I don't like him doing that. Because he just walks up and he'll just say, hmm, let me just take a nibble on this. And then, of course, I make a noise and, and he's like, that's exactly the kind of response I wanted. Him screaming like a little girl. Because <laughs> it's not... It's not fun in, in biting my feet. Anyway, I'm going to leave the video probably right here. This is a long one. 
but it's I think this is a good one. We we do some stuff that we generally don't do and we got some nice pics of Buddy relaxing. And I think he's going to go down into the other room. No. He's back here. Alright, regardless, I'm ending the video. Take care, guys.